Okay, so this is crazy, but I promised myself that if I ran into you, I'd ask. I have both you and Kushida in my WWE Fantasy League. Uh, it's a thing. I'm already near the top of the standings, but if you two team up and win a tag match, we're talking mad points. Ugh, Cameron Grimes has been leaving one-star reviews on my podcast ever since I criticized one of his matches. I even caught Cameron in the act when he was in catering, using the very stealthy username Grimes Rules. Can you knock some sense into him? I'm just trying to do my job. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Manila, Philippines. Weighing in at 269 pounds, the Dragon OJV. It's time to take this night to the moon. The wealthiest man in all of NXT. And his opponent from Burlington, North Carolina, weighing in at 220 pounds, Cameron Grimes. What are you expecting from this superstar tonight, guys? Well, he did say earlier that he's going to attack his opponent with a renewed hostility that we've never seen before. Yeah, he also said he's going to make the competition beg for mercy. Don't go underestimating his opponent, though. Cameron Grimes is something of an old-fashioned brawler whose grit and volatility make him difficult to handle. He's like a keg of gunpowder that's just waiting to blow up in the ring. You said it, Saxton. Cameron Grimes has explosive power and knows how to use it without any mercy. I'm sure Grimes is dead set on inflicting a lot of damage from the top. That gets reversed on Grimes. Whoa! And things kind of blew up in Grimes' face there. Yeah, but he's not breathing heavy yet. Yes, he didn't come here to watch him boast and taunt. Good golly, Miss Molly! Stomping down! Oh, misses the mark! the tables. And Zagiri finds its mark. He turns it around. Kick right to the back of the leg. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Flinged across the way. With the counter. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Lands face first. He's starting to struggle here. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way. Uh-oh. Face first in the turnbuckle. Uh, nowhere to go. Rapid fire kicks. Kick Water trap kicks. kicks. Oh, alley oop power bomb. That might be it. Two count. Oh, and a kick out. How does anyone kick out at this point? And using the springboard misses the target. Stiff kick. And the pressure on Grimes continues to mount. Yeah, Grimes has to consider... Uh-oh, second rope. Guys, oh, that might be the best moonsault ever. I agree. Two, 
Ooh, no, he gets the shoulder up. What do you have to do to put this guy away? Oh, he got him. Is he going to lock this in? And Grimes is finally able to mount some resistance with that. He weathered the storm and wants to create a flurry of his own. What an incredible match we are witnessing. Elusiveness from Grimes. Just defenseless as the momentum is against him. It's starting to come together in a big way for this guy. Bear! Grimes staggering, has no idea what's coming. Knee to the midsection into the pump handle. Here we go. Grimes is completely out of it. Try and end it. One, two, three. And this one is over. Here is your winner, the Dragon, O.J.V. This was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. Okay, so this is crazy, but I promised myself that if I ran into you, I'd ask. I have both you and Kushida in my WWE Fantasy League. Uh, it's a thing. I'm already near the top of the standings, but if you two team up and win a tag match, we're talking mad points. Here comes trouble. The following contest is a tag team match scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 461 pounds. The Dragon O.J.V. and Kushida. Don't forget that while this competitor was trying to carve out a career in Hollywood, he was also a member of the WWE Universe, watching Raw, SmackDown, and NXT every week. That familiarity with WWE has certainly given him an advantage transitioning from entertainment to sports entertainment. And their opponents, at a combined weight of 380 pounds, Oni Lorcan and Danny the WWE Universe more than ready to see this one start. This is going to be good. The WWE Tag Team Division is more competitive than ever. As these two teams get into it, I can almost guarantee this match will be one to remember. The standards for tag team action just keep getting higher and higher around here. Mind Buster. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. 
Yeah, even though he's still got a lot of fight in him, he might want to make a tag now and not risk further harm. Oh, and he moves out of the way. He foiled that attempt. Dodged right on cue. Breaker. Tagging his partner in now. Perch gets countered. Oh, and Seguri. Nasty right hand. And Seguri to the floor. Straight right. Good night. A step up in Zagiri. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. Looks like he has his finger on the trigger now. Scissors kick with authority. Was mounted with punches and not. Oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. If this lands, it's over. Now oh, trampling the opposition. Birch dodges out of that. He's able to fend off the attack. Look at this. Boom. Nice. Goes into the pin. Escape. Close line. An unrelenting assault being brought to Birch. If this lands, it's over. Phoenix Splash. Oh, Birch manages to counter. Yeah, he's able to stop that surge dead in its tracks. Oh, what a wind up. Knee right to the face. Hip toss into the cartwheel. And a knee strike. What a combination. We're undoubtedly nearing the end. Yeah, not looking good at all. He's getting up, but there's danger in front of him. Suicide. Oh, God. That, that, that's a bad landing. An absolutely foolhardy decision made there. That could be very costly. I don't know if the risk was worth it. out of it. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the rest count, Cole. Eight. Nine. Look at him. Pride and poise personified. Into a ripcord lariat. What a combination. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. If this lands, it's over. Through the air. And connects. Just crashing down with high impact. And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. Two. Oh, suicide tornado DDT. That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. We'll slide back in the ring now. Tag is made, and here we go. Chop. And out of the ring he goes. He is revving up the end. No way. What a cross body. It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. Encounters. Punch! Oh, 
Uh oh. Oh, there's the Pele kick. Oni Lorcan is showing signs that it could be ending soon. I don't want to say he's done, but I can hear the fat lady warming up. Oh, what a spear! Cover! And he kicks out of the pen in one. We are this far into the match. Where is this energy coming from? Another reversal. Eye for an eye here. Into a ripcord lariat. What a combination. Delivers the leg drop. Oni Larkin in a state of distress. Oni needs the restrain. Taking flight. Five star frog splat. Is it enough? The cover. A striking blow. Rights and lefts, elbows, knees, all of them lethal. Counter. And now there's an opening. Oh, and a spear. That's got to be it. And the count stopped short of two. Not quite enough to put him away. Check this out. Just deadlift it up into a powerbomb. Oh, knee to the face. He continues to press forward. Yeah, he is being steadfast in his approach. Climbing the turnbuckle now. If this lands, it's over. Good Lord, that's it. Call the match. Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. Costly error there. Drop toe hold. Oh man. Producing a trampling. Oh boy, he's stalking him. Watching for an opening. Dragon twist cutter. Lorkin counters. There's a combo of strikes. Rights and lefts, elbows, knees, all of them lethal. Boom! Claymore delivered. And Lorkin keeps it at bay. He's going for it all. He's looking completely lost as he finds his footing. Take off. DDT with diving delivery. Amazing. Wow. Bottom rope moonsault on the mark. Attempting high risk move after high risk move at a breakneck pace. Delivers the leg drop. Consecutive attacks keeping Lorkin off his game. Oni needs to re strategize right away. Responds with a counter of their own. Oh, and a spear! There you go, Cole. Setting up spear! Oh my gosh, what impact! He isn't finding any space to recover. He's got to boost up his levels of aggression at the. Knee the midsection into the pump handle. Here we go. X Factor. And that can keep Oni down. Cover. There's two. Ah, oh, he was almost finished. Had to dig deep to break that pin. But can it be done again? How much is left after that? What's the tally on how many times we thought this match was coming to... Hoping to end it here. This is it. He breaks the ref's count before two. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. Hoist it all the way up. KOD. Night, night. Ah, oh, Birch manages to counter. Now Birch looking for some momentum. Prime opportunity now for Birch to get some separation. And this is it. And got the win. That is a huge win here tonight.
and Kushida. Tag team. What are you doing here? Did you get signed to NXT? No, not yet. But I hope that changes after tonight. I have a non-televised match to show management what they're missing out on. And I was hoping I could face you. Okay, I'll do it. Great. So how do we want to approach this? I'm not gonna let you win or anything like that, but I'll do my best to help you look good by having an entertaining match. That work for you? Yeah, definitely, for sure. But what if you let me hit my finisher? You know, really show the bosses what I'm all about. Chase. Fine, forget I said it, but... What about a signature move? Would that be all right? Chase.
If you haven't already heard, the NXT Breakout Tournament is right around the corner. This year, it's open to NXT and NXT UK superstars who've never received an NXT title opportunity, which means you're eligible. What does the winner get? Confident one, are we? The winner will earn a championship match of their choice at NXT TakeOver. So, are you interested in participating? This is the opportunity I've been waiting for. I'm in. All right, good luck. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Manila, Philippines. Weighing in at 269 pounds, the Dragon OJV. Here he comes, the high flyer of Legado del Fantasma. And his opponent, representing Legado del Fantasma from Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 175 pounds, Joaquin Wilde. Didn't this dude used to be a DJ? Uh, he used to be a DJ. Some would say now much more reserved, but I say more focused on the task at hand. Much as it pains me to, Saxton, I completely agree with you. Joaquin Wilde, well, he used to be the life of the party. Now he just lives for competition. As this first round match gets underway, let's not forget what's on the line. Whoever wins the NXT Breakout Tournament will earn a championship opportunity at NXT TakeOver. I don't think that's lost on either of these men, especially Joaquin Wilde, who looks ready to make a run in this tournament. Wilde has been here before, losing to Angel Garza in his debut in the first ever breakout tournament. You have to think he'll use that as extra motivation tonight. He's looking a little off balance. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. Really just laying it in. Oh, well scouted by Wilde. Control. Oh, the wind just knocked right out with that. Claymore! Good night! Wow! Bottom rope for a moonsault. Cover! Two! And a kick out. He got close there. It could be do or die time. What a counter! Escape just in time. Set him up. Russian leg sweep. Hooked up. DDT. He gets out of the way. Wild holds him on. Headed to the top now. Flying. Star Frog Splash! Is it enough? The cover! Shoulder up, shoulder up! There's some shock in the arena after that kick out.
And now Wilde is being measured. Hits him with the counter. Oh, what a kick. And that catches Wilde looking. Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. Need the midsection into the pump handle. Here we go. Wilde gets out of there. Uh-oh. Poison run. Face crusher. Off the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? From the top. That one fails to land. Missed the mark. Man, that was a hard landing. Oh, what a kick. Big blow could be felt throughout the arena. Going way up high. If this lands, it's over. Phoenix Splash. Oh, no. Now possibly setting up for a submission maneuver. Dragon Sleeper applied. It's not in bed. He gives up. It's over. It's over. All in a nice work. Here is your winner, the Dragon. Oh, JV. Wrestle perhaps the perfect match. Never any doubt in this win. This is what you get when you have complete confidence and control of the situation. So I guess we stand in each other's way of making it to the finals? Yeah, looks that way. Who would have thought after all our battles at the PC we'd be facing each other again with so much on the line? I saw how talented you were at the PC, so I'm not surprised. But I want you to know that even though we respect each other, I'm not going to take it easy on you. I want this title opportunity more than anything. I feel the same way. So may the best man win. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Manila, Philippines. Weighing in at 269 pounds, the Dragon OJV. This superstar first carved out a niche for himself in VOD movies and reality TV, but critics say stepping in the ring is going too far. Well, regardless of anyone's opinion, he impressed the team at the Performance Center with his outstanding progress and earned a WWE roster spot. Now, let's see what he does with it. Oh, 
It's the fighting pride of Mexico, Hector Flores. And his opponent from Guadalajara, Jalisco, Mexico, weighing in at 202 pounds, Hector Flores. Tradition and history mean everything to Hector Flores. That's why he's here fighting his heart out in WWE. Hector's ready to put his name right up there next to his childhood heroes. Here we go as two former training partners from the Performance Center square off in this NXT Breakout Tournament semi-final match. When two competitors know each other as well as these ones do, it might just come down to who wants it more. Or it might come down to who's better. Let's not overthink this, Sexton. Ah, oh, dragon screw ankle breaker. Shifts it back onto him. Stomping. Ouch. And using the... The springboard attack fails to land. And Tagiri finds its mark. He's getting a little battered now. It's nothing he hasn't been through before. Double knee backbreaker. Kick to the gut. Double under. Oh, future shock. Wow. Bottom rope moonsault. That was unique. Whoa, not quite yet. Now a drop kick. Oh my, dragon screw. Right to the spine. Lands the cross body. Legs caught. Oh, down by the DDT. is on the springboard. Jarring impact. He's getting pushed out into the defensive. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. Incoming! Steer clear of that. Kick! He saw that one coming. Overhand right lands. Oh, and a reversal. Flores isn't looking good as he stirs back up. Needed the midsection into the pump handle. Here we go. X Factor. Is it enough to put Flores away? These two men are giving it their all with so much at stake in this NXT breakout tournament. Irish whip. And the referee got caught sleeping. Now we're really going to find out who wants to advance. Wait a second. We've got company. It's Joaquin Wilde. Yeah, and he brought a guest of his own in the form of a kendo stick. Wilde's taking out his frustration after losing in the tournament last week. Hector Flores has no idea what just happened. And now Hector's going up top to capitalize. This could do it. And down with the frog splash. And Flores secures the victory, advancing to the finals of the NXT Breakout Tournament. After what Wilde did tonight, I think their issue is far from over. Yeah, Joaquin Wilde just cost him a potential championship opportunity at NXT TakeOver. That's not going to sit well with anybody. I think Hector just realized what occurred, and he's not too happy about it. Too bad. Take the win and move on.
This superstar looks determined tonight. Whoa, from behind! They're gonna settle this right now. And we've got a big commotion going on backstage. An old-fashioned fight near the locker room. Nothing around to contain the anarchy. Home run! He's got him scouted! Answering back! Knee right to the face! Talk about dismantling your opponent. Ah, oh, foot just stomping down. Standing moonsault. Down right on the neck. Wild gets out of there. Spear! Ooh! Ooh! Boom! Evades their offense. Dragon twist cutter. Oh! Oh, man! He just barely dodges. Look at this, going counter for counter. Oh, what a German suplex. Oh! Oh! Slips out of the way. And Wild with the wherewithal to counter. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Gets him with the counter. Man, just a multitude of strikes. Wow. Oh, it was a stunner. That was the best one I've ever seen. And now Wild is being measured. Double underhook up and Man. wing clipper. Wild gets out of there. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Boom. Oh. Knew what was coming there. He fends off the attack. That catches Wild looking. Oh. Oh. Boom. Oh. Oh! Oh! Ooh, man! Oh! Ooh! Oh! Oh! And he's able to reverse! Saw that one coming. And finds a counter. Can't quite get him there. Great wherewithal on the counter! Here it is, the Wing Clipper! He's reeling, slowly getting up. Yeah. Double underhook, up and butterfly! Knockout victory!
The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Manila, Philippines. Weighing in at 269 pounds, the Dragon O.J.V. Here he comes, the high flyer of Legado del Fantasma. And his opponent, representing Legado del Fantasma from Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 175 pounds, Joaquin Wilde. The issue between these two started during the NXT Breakout Tournament and will come to a conclusion here at TakeOver. Joaquin Wilde cost his opponent a spot in the finals of the Breakout Tournament, and things have only gotten more heated between them in recent weeks. Look, both of them hoped they'd be competing in a championship match tonight, and now they're going to take out that frustration on each other. Wild holds him off. Rip Ripcord into the lariat. He's absorbed some damage already. He planned for this and could still rally. Bottom rope for Moonsault. Ooh, well measured. And Wild with the wherewithal to counter. Oh, what a spear! Crafty way to get out of harm there. Oh, the old whipper snapper. Wild is in a state of distress. Wild's gonna have to dig down deep here. Uh oh, jawbreaker! Call the dentist. Oh, look at these kicks! Oh. Knee oh. right to the face. Setting it up. Thunderous clothesline. He's returning fire. A ah, jumping stop to the gun. Strong Whoa. kick. My goodness. What a close line. Ouch. Wild holds him off. Sidekick finds the mark. A ah, club with a right forearm. He knows how to avoid contact. Oh, look at these kicks. Knee oh. right to the face. Just broken something. Staved off that attack. On the back of the neck, what's coming here? For the win! Two count! Yeah, no, he doesn't get the three. This is no time to hesitate. You can feel the end coming. If this lands, it's over. Taking this match off the mat now. Oh, look out. Five star frog splash. That's gonna be it. Two. No, a two count. How in the world did he kick out? Wild gets out of there. Reversal on Wild. There you go, Cole. He's heading up top. Thinking big. Sky high. Five star frog splash. Looking for the victory. Two. And that'll about do it, folks. Here is your winner, the Dragon. O.J.V. No other way to put it, guys. That was kind of a butt kicking. An absolute...